Hello, my name is Caitlin with West Palm Dog, and today I'm here with Emma, and we're working on her go to bed. Now, go to bed's a really useful command to have because you're able to put your dog anywhere you need to, and they're going to stay on the mat unless otherwise super or unless directed otherwise. But like everything else, we got to get the basics down. So today I'm standing in front of the mat, and I'm going to throw some food and call Emma over to it. Emma. Go to bed. And I'm going to go ahead and wait for Emma. It's really important to wait your dog out, give them the chance ah, ah, to do what you're asking. Now right there, Emma popped up. So I just went ahead and made a negative noise and I'm going to wait for her. Hey. You see Emma's trying to figure out what I'm wanting. Now I'm going to go ahead and help her out because Emma's having a little trouble today. Yes, good girl. And I'm going to treat multiple times to imply that stay. This just prevents Emma from taking the food and running off. Okay, I'm going to do that again. Oh, nice catch. <laughs> Emma, go to bed. I'm going to go ahead and wait for her again. You see she's sitting, so she's halfway there. But it's really important that we make sure her elbows are hitting the mat before we're giving any treats or giving any yeses. Hey. Yes, good girl. Once again, I'm just treating multiple times. Okay, good girl. Now we're going to do that one more time. Emma, go to bed. Once again, I'm just going to wait her out. Hey, uh -uh. now if Emma starts to walk away, I'm going to go ahead and bring her right back. It's really important that we follow through with commands, make sure the dog understands that we are not asking, we are telling. Now go ahead, help her out. Yes, good girl. Once again, I'm just going to treat multiple times. But you see, that's why it's really important to wait at your dog and to follow through with commands. Okay? And that was a really nice job from Emma. You see, she was having a bit of a tougher day today. She was refusing to go to bed. But still, as you saw, I just used my food, brought her back, and really emphasized that I was telling her to go to bed. And as you can see, she went down. Really important to wait your dog out. Give them the chance to do what you're asking. But of course, correct them if they're not. Really nice job from Emma today, though.